hi guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video so guys in today's video i have another product empties haul for y'all and this one has been honestly long overdue like y'all have been holding these empty containers <laughs> for months and i'm just ready to get rid of it honestly so yeah um without any further ado let's get right into this video Alright guys, so as usual, this haul is not going to be in any particular order and I'm just going to share my thoughts and opinion on these products that I've used. So the first item that I have is this Garnier Fructis, um hair mask. I actually bought this when I was in Martinique because I was out of deep conditioner and I wanted one and they don't really have like a lot of brands that i am familiar with so this was the only one that i knew and this flavor is in banana which i've never seen here sold in trinidad and you're this smells so good like oh oh my gosh it smells so good y'all <laughs> so that was a plus for me and um yeah like it works pretty fine it works the typical way the other um deep conditioners usually work and uh, like honestly no complaints and i would definitely buy this back if i well if i go to Masnik or if i even see this selling locally i'm gonna buy this next i have this face wash and this is from simple it is a cleansing wash and this one actually is has no sense no sense sorry so it doesn't say that on the front but i remember that yeah like it actually has no sense um it's kind of like uh close to a gel um texture and it's clear so there's no color coloring in it as well no alcohol no perfumes and i like this i really like this face, face wash it didn't do anything you know supernatural <laughs> but i feel like it did its job and i think a plus it was that it didn't have any scent to it or fragrance i should say and uh, yeah because i feel like sometimes those things could like irritate your skin and yeah just cause irritation so i'm trying to as much as i can get products that um don't have like any perfumes or scents in it because um, I feel like it's just better for your skin. So this is a yes for me and I would buy this back. I have here with me this bottle of Dove body wash. And I cannot even tell you all what it is in because it's in Spanish. So yeah. But there's definitely vanilla in it and some sort of nut or something. And y'all, this smells really good. Again, um, I would buy this back. And Dove body wash is typically what I use. So yeah, like I'm gonna so buy this back if I see this. Next I have here is this bottle of Jurgen's cream. And this one comes in the scent, so cherry almond. And y'all, one thing about Jurgen's, like it made me surreal, like, see the difference between Jurgen's and St. Ives. It's a very thick lotion and it's really good for moisturizing and that's what it says here, it moisturizes and softens like I love it but of course Jurgen's, Jurgen, sorry, is more on the expensive side as compared to St. Ives so yeah I love this lotion and I would say like if you want maybe like a more something with a good scent something that's thick and moisturizing like to use when you're going out you can definitely use jurgens and if you're just at home you know whatever i would recommend like using like saint eyes because it's a bit on the lighter and watery side so you don't need nothing too expensive or fancy but yeah i'm gonna buy this back probably if i don't have a choice <laughs> because <laughs> we're trying to save here but uh, if I had to buy Jurgens, I would buy it back. Next I have here your is the Cantu Avocado um, Hydrating Curl Activator and this one is with avocado oil and shea butter. 
y'all. Y'all. When I tell you I love this, I love this. I know a lot of people complain about Kansu saying that it's not moisturizing and like dries all their hair. But y'all, if you have curly hair, try this because this really does moisturize your hair compare compared to the ordinary um curl activator that they have this is very moisturizing and it could be because of that avocado and shea butter that they have in it but y'all i love this and let's not even get started talking about the scent <laughs> Just know that your hair is going to be smelling so good when it is you use this. Like, I kid you not, like, y'all just go in Pennywise and if you see this, like, just open your bottle and smell it and you will see what I am talking about. Like, this I highly recommend and I would most certainly buy this back again. Alright, so I have this charcoal face. What is it? A face mask yeah a clay mask yeah it, it literally writes on your bottle <laughs> so i have this charcoal clay mask with me that i just bought in pennywise and honestly y'all i feel like i still have a little bit okay, no. <laughs> like sometimes when i go to buy like face mask i don't really feel like there's a lot of popular brands or options so honestly, y'all, I just be taking the most affordable thing. So at the point in time when I bought this, it's because I wanted to get a face mask. And I saw this and I was like, mm, okay, let me just try it, see how it works, whatever. And you know, charcoal is good, so yeah. So it says that it absorbs excess oils and deeply cleanses the skin. It draws out deep-rooted dirt. And yeah, to me, it worked fine, like... If I saw it again, like if I was in the market again, like I would have buy this. This one is not like a peel off mask. You do when it dries and it gets well it's clay, so when it gets hard, like you do have to um wash it out. Um or use a brush to scrub it out. So yeah, I feel like it really does get into your pores and really cleans cleans your face well. So yeah. If you've never tried it and you're looking for a clay mask, you can try this one because this one is actually more affordable than Aztec, which I feel like Aztec did nothing for me and was so expensive. So this is a good replacement for that. So next I have this bottle of zinc gummies and this is from Nature Bounties. Yo, I really wanted to invest in zinc and uh, of course I wanted gummies. <laughs> So I got the one from Nature Bronties because uh, I use the multivitamin. So yeah, I find that these gummies taste really good. Um, I don't really feel because this is my first time using it, and I don't feel as if like I saw any major differences. But I am going to continue to use it, and uh, yeah, maybe I'll let you all know in another video if I notice any significance in it but yeah this if you want an affordable zinc vitamin in gummy form you can definitely check out this brand all right guys now we're almost close to the end of this video next I have this bottle of suave hand sanitizer yo where did I buy this I actually had bought this in extra foods it was like a plenty for 20 special and uh, yeah, I just want to. I found out, I thought it was a good deal, so I just bought it. So, there's really nothing special to say about it because it's just hand sanitizer. I can't tell you if it killed the germs or not because I can't see germs. But, yeah. Um, would I buy it back? Yeah, why not? I guess. But,. Yeah, nothing special here to say about this. <laughs> okay, so next I have this Color Me Perfume. And this is the purple, well, obviously, clearly you can see it's purple. But yeah, this is the purple one. If you've never um, tried it before, let me see. It's literally like empty. 
But anyways, yo, I had, this wasn't even mine, like it was actually my sister's. And it's just been there and no one was using it. So I'm like, let me finish it. Like, you know, I don't like to just see things sitting there and it's like, no. Um, so anyways, yeah. Um, I actually like this scent because I feel like I personally had another color and I wasn't really too much. I don't even remember what color it was. But I wasn't too much of a fan, so I preferred this purple scent um, over the one that I had, which I don't remember. But if you're looking for something cheap and that smells good, you can try one of Color Me's perfume. And last but not least, y'all, I have this Dove deodorant. And this one, oh, well, the writing has already started to come out, but it's the Invisible. So I think you're not supposed to see any marks when you put it on. It's Anyways, let's pretend like that didn't just happen. Um, but yeah, it's supposed to be invisible when you put it underneath your arm and it's really small. And I just find that like deodorant is like one of the products that they just rub you. They rub you. Because I'm expecting deodorant to start from the bottom. They literally make it like halfway. It's like, why? But anyways, one thing about this, it smells good. I do do find, however, that it doesn't really last. This is in the scent vanilla and peach, and it says 48 hour protection. This is more like 48 minutes protection. Yeah. When I was using this, I remember very clearly having to reapply this more than once during the day. Like, I don't find it did anything so I'm not gonna be repurchasing this anyways guys that brings me to the end of this product empties video I hope that you enjoyed it comment below let me know which one of these products that you have tried before and what are your thoughts on them and if there's a product that I shared with you today that you've never tried um, let me know as well in the comment section below. So thank you again for watching today's video and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!